What is up guys, my name is Jack O'Brien and welcome back to Interest Things. With the continually advancing technology industry in our world today, it is inevitable that technology will continue to revolutionize our world as well as change the way our society functions just as it already has in cases such as the internet and cell phones. One of the technologies that people see as becoming much more critical in the near future is 3D printing technology. At the beginning of 3D printing, it was more of a gimmick than anything game-changing. At first, universities and institutions had a few 3D printers and used them to print things such as plastic 3D models of cities or even just artwork pieces. 3D printers were not being used to their full potential at this time as the technology had just been developed. 3D printers were essentially like computers in their early days. Computers were originally huge machines that could do next to nothing compared to our cell phones. And this is how many scientists view 3D printers right now. As our current printers are large and slow, they will eventually become faster and smaller and able to do a whole lot more, just like computers have. 3D printers right now are just at the beginning, just like computers were only a few decades ago. The only thing is that 3D printers are going to advance a whole lot faster than computers did. And here are a few things we can expect to see from 3D printers soon. One major prediction coming from both technology and economic experts is that in the next decade we can expect to see companies such as Nike go from being clothing companies to software companies. This is because one big prediction concerning 3D printers is that in the near future, people will essentially be able to print anything in their own homes. This drastically shakes up the way economics are currently structured, as instead of Nike having to both design the shoe, manufacture the shoe, and then ship and sell the shoe, they would instead just have to design the shoe and then sell the software to someone else who would then print it at their own home. This won't just be for shoes and clothing, but essentially anything that we manufacture in factories right now could potentially be made by 3D printers in people's homes. Instead of selling products, companies will sell the software to a product, similar to the way games are sold by product keys. This would enable people to show that they had paid for something and then be able to print it at their own home. There are still issues with cybersecurity concerned with this, but as technology continues to advance, we can assume that so will cybersecurity. 3D printers will also be able to print with a large amount of materials, including a living tissue. 3D printing organs is currently still something being researched and experimented with, but over the next decade, 3D printing an organ might be a common medical procedure. 3D printing technology will also aid in the advancement of nanotechnology. This is because 3D printers are able to print on a nano scale. With the speed and precision of 3D printers, nanotechnology will be much more economically feasible, and for that reason, nanotechnology will advance much faster. Scientists at Harvard University have already used 3D printing and nanotechnology in order to create a lithium ion battery that is the size of a grain of sand. Industrial design is a field that looks to optimize efficiency through design. 3D design software such as CAD are currently used in order to create the most efficient design for a product. In the near future, 3D printers combined with new computer technology that utilizes AI might be used in order to create new designs that people would have never thought of before. This is because 3D printing essentially gives unlimited freedom when designing geometric shapes. This, along with new printing materials and AI development, will allow for 3D printers to create designs that are stronger and more efficient than humans could have ever designed before. 3D printing is cool, but let's take it to the next level with 4D printing. 4D printing is a technology that is being researched by MIT, which looks to create a structure that changes shape at a later time when interacting with a new condition. For example, this could be a 3D brick, 
that does not expand to its full size until water is applied to it. 4D printing will have many implications in building infrastructure and might even be able to create self-repairing structures in the near future. 3D printers certainly have some ways to go before reaching their maximum potential, but just as computers originated as big, slow machines that couldn't really do much, 3D printers too will evolve over time and become faster and more efficient and eventually revolutionize our world in more ways than we can imagine. What do you guys think? Do you think that over the next decade, 3D printers will be one of the most important technologies that our society has developed? Let me know in the comments down below and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.